quit is getting the dishwasher emptied and before we go further into the video i'm going to go ahead and introduce myself to you guys those that are new my name is candace i am a wife and a mother to three boys um, me and my husband we've been together for 22 years but we've been married for 11 years and i'm currently not working but i am a medical assistant hopefully i'll be working soon <laughs> But um, on my channel, I do clean, cleaning, motivations, decorating, organization, hauls, um, homemaking, and anything we do as moms to keep our homes together. So if that's something you're interested in, I would love for you to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. So now that I got the dishwasher empty, I'm going to go ahead and place the rest of these dishes in the dishwasher. And I just want to see how you guys are doing today. Today is Tuesday, September the 24th, while I'm doing this voiceover. And I just want to see how you guys are doing. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you're doing today, if you're doing anything. <laughs> And now that I got all the dishes put up, I'm just going to go ahead and get my knives clean. Um, I used to put my knives in the washing machine, not the washing machine, but the dishwasher. And they had started getting dull. So now I just hand wash them with some cold water and they stay sharper a little longer. Um, I didn't know that at before until I saw somebody do it and I was wondering why my knives was getting dull and that was the reason why but um this video is like a over a course of some days sometimes you just can't get things done in one day and after I cleaned my countertops on this day I didn't feel like doing anything else so I just sat down and waited till the next day to get some more done Now I'm going to go ahead 
ahead and get this stove top clean off. I have a love hate relationship with this stove top, but I'm just gonna use the Dawn Power Wash and I'm also gonna sprinkle a little comet on top of it. And this combination did a wonderful job. I didn't have to use a razor blade to scrape anything off. I just used this sponge, kind of have like one side of it just a little hard, harder than the other one. And it did just the job. And you can have my Saturday nights. I could be a Sunday morning, weekend paradise. Mm -hmm. We could do whatever you like. Make all of my dreams come true. Yeah, you can have all of my So yesterday y'all saw me cleaning, well starting to clean the kitchen, but I didn't even get a chance to finish it. Um, once I, I wiped down those countertops, I just want to sit down. I didn't want to do anything else, and sometimes it's like that. Sometimes you start on something, don't want to finish it, and I didn't want to make myself do it because I probably would have messed up something. So <laughs> today is a new day. Today is... Saturday, September the 21st. So I'm here in my bedroom. I'm gonna get my bed made up and and then I'm gonna show you guys the little fall decorations that I put in here. Y'all don't mind this on my head. I really need a hairdo and I didn't feel like doing my hair this morning, so I have this on there. So y'all don't pay that any attention. <laughs> but um I'm gonna get my bed made up first. And then I'm going to show you guys a close-up of all the decorations that I did in my room. So that I can make a little room for us, I wish I never should in star that you still come back to my heart. So now that I got the bed made up, uh, I already had recorded uh, me where I decorated my room. So I'm going to go ahead and insert that video in right now. So this is like an overview of my room. Y'all got so much stuff in here till it don't make no sense. But I live in a mobile home and 
I don't have that much space, so I guess I have to utilize every inch that I can use. But um, this is my dresser. I'm gonna have these florals here that I got from Hobby Lobby. This vase also from Hobby Lobby. Yeah, I gotta do a makeover on this dresser and stuff so bad. Look at it. The green, look at it. Paint coming off. It's turning yellow in some spots. But um I got this um I guess you call it adobo with some pumpkins inside. Me and my husband's picture. Y'all don't mind a pile of shoes over there. This is my husband's side of the nightstand, which I had this vase that I DIY'd. Um, it was a pink color that I got from at home. And I just put some of that compound on it and painted it this color. It looks gray on here, but it's like a light brown color. And it added these florals that I got from, shoot, where did I get these things from? I think I got those from at home. This clock that I got from Target. Um, the book from Home Goods, the candle from Target. This lamp I already had, but it came from at home as well. This is my bed. I've tried to call myself make it look kind of like hotel bed, but it'll do. <laughs> the pillowcases I got from the Timu, the smaller one. I don't even remember what. Oh, the small, the insert I got from TJ Maxx, but the pillowcase I got off of Timu. And then the smaller pumpkin here, I got from Hobby Lobby. But um, this pillowcase is just some pumpkins in the front, and I just flipped it over. I might just leave it like that, <laughs> cause that's all the pillowcases that I had. So I just decided to go ahead and use those. And this is my side of the nightstand, same lamp florals vase um i have my little phone charger um thing charges my phone watch and my earbuds which i got off of timu um here is where i put my jewelry in when i take them off at night time i got that from the salvation army thrift store also have a candle here from Target and a book from Home Goods. Um, up here on my Chester, this is mine. I need to add some florals in the base, which I have not gotten yet. Also up here on this wardrobe, I have a vase up there to the top that I also need to find some florals for. And then over here on my husband's chester, just below the TV, I just added this little pumpkin. And that's pretty much all I did here in my room. I didn't do too much. And it's just a few things I need to get off the floor. We're pretty much, we have really nothing, just those clothes hanging and some socks. <laughs> but um, that's pretty much all I did here in my room, not much. But um, so, what y'all think of the bedroom? Um, I didn't do too much in here. It's just, like I said, it's a few things that I do need to get, like some more florals to put in the vases, the two vases that I have in here. And hopefully, I can get this room some type of a makeover. It'll probably be after the holidays, once I figure out what I want to do. Because it's, it's a little too bright for me. <laughs> um... But yeah, go ahead and I guess finish getting the kitchen finished. And then we'll see what else we can get into.
So I do have some little projects that I got going on. I'm not doing it on YouTube because it'll probably be a long process and I'm not even finished with it yet. So I didn't want to prolong it. But um, I will show you guys once I finish how it looked before and how it looks after. But um, let's go ahead and talk about the giveaway that I'm going to be doing to show you guys my appreciation for the 500 subscribers. So to be a part of the giveaway, you must be a subscriber. Um, give this video a big thumbs up and leave me a comment down below of one of your childhood's fondest memories that you have. It could be anything. It could be something you did with your parents or something with friends because i'm very interested in knowing <laughs> and that will also give me a chance to know a little bit about my subscribers and a winner i will announce on next friday's video so y'all be on the lookout for that and the gift that i'm going to be giving away is a 25 dollar gift card from target so, all the details about the giveaway will be down in the description section. So, we're going to go ahead and get finished with the cleaning up. Alright, so, the next thing I want to do is get my chairs clean. I'm going to show you all guys what they look like before I get started cleaning them. And y'all should be able to tell which chairs the kids sit in and which ones the adults sit in. 
So if y'all can see, I got all this so messed up in here, over here, and I think it's just it's four chairs like that. I don't think you can see this one that good. You see all the discoloration up in this area here. This one right here is not too bad. I have got like a little few spots of spot right there. And then the chair over here. It's not too bad, not too bad, but you can tell right here, here, over here. And these two chairs right here are the ones I mostly sit in. And look at the difference. <laughs> Big difference compared to the other four chairs. So we're gonna go ahead, get those sprayed with the OxyClean stuff here, right here. And then we're gonna go ahead and get those like, out so they can be drying before the kids sit in it. how the water look after cleaning the chairs you can kind of tell that was a little nasty because the water is a little cloudy and then i'm going to show you guys how the chairs turned out another day today is monday what september the doo -doo -doo -doo. Check my watch. september 23rd i just came back from the grocery store i'm gonna show y'all a little haul that i have so i went to walmart um yesterday sunday we went to sales but i didn't record anything um like that um 
Sam was crying, y'all. I was going to record in Sam's yesterday, but Sam's had a lot of people. I didn't know a lot of people go to Sam's on Sunday. But um, we just came home. We put the stuff up, and I just didn't record it. But this is my haul from Walmart. So the first thing I got is this can of tuna. I got the four-pack. I got a can of diced tomatoes. A pack of asparagus broccoli I got two cans of these mixed chili beans for some chili got some sea salt some pork beans some zucchini and I got this recipe that I'm gonna try since I'm trying to get on this little health journey and I'll probably share that with you guys when I make it it's something that I got off of Pinterest um, I got this herbic and garlic and herb butter. I got some whole okra. I got two red onions, some whole milk, some Welch's Welch's passion fruit juice, y'all. And it, y'all, it's I've been looking for this for the longest, and I finally got my hands on some. I didn't want to make my own. I tried to make my own, but it really didn't turn out that good. So, I got this. I like this brand of Bird's Eye. Um, I got the sour cream and chives. And I got two of the roasted garlic. Let's see. I got two packs of the chili. The 30% less sold one. I got the kids some these frosted sugar cookies. I got some garlic toast i got these atkins protein bars that i want to try and it tastes pretty good um i got four packs of these salt and vinegar chips just to add with my kids other chips that they have i got some legumes i got two boxes of cereal i got the honey nut chicks and frosted flakes i got a carton of 12 brown eggs and then over here on the other side y'all don't mind the dirty stove i need to clean it again i got uh, a pack of these ritz peanut butter crackers my kids love those some ocean spray cream watermelon and cream raspberry lemonade um pack of the Ritz crackers got these oats and honey granola for my yogurts. Got some peanut butter, these little kosher deal, the mini petite um, size. Sometimes I snack on it when it ain't nothing else to snack on, or it's something that I don't need to be getting. <laughs> I snack on those. I got some of these red lobster cheddar bay biscuit mix, some cheese its I got these better goods, balsamic vinegar crackers. And I've never tried these before, so I'll be excited to try these. I'll eat these with when I make a tuna. And then I got some quicker chewy chocolate chip for the kids. And then over here. This is my meat side. I put all my meats over here. I got the butter ball turkey sausage. Got two packs of those. I got the Hillshire Farm turkey smoked sausages. These for my husband. I eat both, but he mostly like these. I wanted to try these. I got some all natural turkey mix that we like to eat. I got my youngest son, he was begging me for some of these one day. I got it for him and he loved it and he wanted, he wanted another pack, so I got him another one. Um, I got some Italian sausages, ground turkey. This is a roast. These are some pork chops and these are some chicken wings. And that's it for my little haul. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and get everything put up. Ooh, all right, y'all. I wanted to um do an outro for the video. Sorry, just a little simple little video. What I did had going on through the week. Y'all, excuse me for what I look like. I just got through working out. Whew. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a big thumbs up. The giveaway will be down in the description section. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.